Hello, Luigi Noids. This is Luigi X Rules. Playing Mario and Luigi's Bowser's Inside Story. In the last episode, I did something unforgivable. Scratch a scratch card? No. Somehow, for some reason, I said no to scratching a scratch card. Why would anybody do that? Like, ah! Uh, I'm so mad at myself, but. This episode, we're gonna make up for it by listening to this music for a bit, because we got some new enemies to fight. Not that many left until we get 15. Yeah, you gotta punch those guys to shut them up. You gotta punch them better than that. There. And the, so let's get this guy's bloody out of him. And also, the, who's on things. Got a bloody. Spavon things also went down there. Is there an enemy that Mario and Luigi can fight? Oh, they just explode. My gosh, that's a lot of lucky hits. <laughs> now we get to see this guy's attack. It'll spawn a bunch of blocks. Oh, that's not good. Got a shell. Yep, that's a problem. This guy couldn't put dizzy. Can't really shell it very well. Stupid thing. There we go, at least we got some HP back. It's only attack, surprisingly enough. Uh oh, I did it wrong again. Two, three, four. You can only block six at a time, it looks like. Alright, just gotta destroy him. Nice, that levels up Bowser to level 24. Good to get him some levels, too. Let's see, what's looking good on you? Horn, apparently. Glad I didn't get that one. <laughs> <laughs> Wonder if Horn's just always something that needs upgrading. Love Deep Castle. What's in this block? Ultra Syrup Jar. Ooh, getting some good items. Got more nap rocks. Let's see if fire does anything special to these one guys. Yeah, they just instantly die. Alright, not bad so far. Apparently with a lucky hit we can just one and the first strike we can just one shot at naps nap lock, so they're nothing to worry about. We got some kinda of locked the door. Uh Waffle Copters! Oh hey, look what happened! Bowser's in Peach's Castle! You're so full of yourself! Told you I'd make it here! Waffle Waffle won't lie! Waffle that's shock at you getting here! But that shock turns the tutorials as you stop here. There are doors here that need keys, and Popple has them. You will wander forever in my modified pe castle of Peach until you cry from lack of doors. Pfft. I'll break them down. You have energy like a little angry battery with no friends. But even if you get past the doors, the castle of Peach. Oh, but I have secrecy. Popple says no more. Are you catching me, fa my Popple copters? Got a green door, red door, and a blue door. Huh? Some kind of arm. Over there. Oh! Got some caged magic Koopas. Huh, there might be a new attack to show off soon. So got multiple ways to go. Down here is one of them. The blue one went over there. Ooh, hey, a dining hall. In Peach's castle. It's hiding behind that. Which we can just use our shell to break. I'm just going over to the left. Remember, just press the direction and they'll continue in that direction. Nothing back there. Guess I can save real quick. I guess realistically I could have tagged that onto the last episode, but eh, whatever. Oh, that's what happens if you miss the alarm bomb. Oof. Game is getting hard. It took like three minutes on that one battle and what? Oh, that's another new enemy that right there. Alright, fight it. This thing. Whoa. 
dang it. Thing heals for 100 HP, that would have been very useful right about now. This is what's known as a Dark Trasher. And he just ran away. Okay. Alright, we'll just have to fight that guy again sometime. No one cares, Google. Sorry, whenever my family enters the house, that noise will appear. So nothing in here, apparently. But in the secret room, there's a max syrup jar and 150 coins. And then that leads down to there. So anything else across here? Um, there's another exit. Huh. This area seems pretty big. Oh, hey, another place to body slam. I haven't seen one of those in a while. Um, whoops. This is kind of a different version of Seesaw Fit, I guess. Alright. Can get a Power Band Plus, not DX for some reason. This, um, raises power. Alright, well, that doesn't seem... Surprised it's not Power Band DX, that's usually what those things are. Alright, can't go that way yet. And so this is more of a way to get back. We explore it up here. See what's down here. Oh, hey, that's the green one. Okay, we go over here, and nope. It's like, nope. And climb up onto that ledge. Can get up here. Not that that really does anything, except... When we're up here, we can side punch to over here. And then, there it is. And... We get the green key! So the blue key is the one that's required. But there's also the optional green key and red key, it seems. Got more nap locks. Ooh. No! Well, at least he got healed first. Whoa, those cannonballs do a lot of damage. Oh, got this thing now. Uh, we'll see what that does later. Oh, we're already at a, another le level up almost. Oh, yeah, block. 50 coins? Eh. That doesn't seem that useful. Oh, another new enemy. Looks very similar to an enemy we've already fought. Did not mean to do that, but luckily we didn't get the first strike. Ah, should have shelled it. Alright, so there's two enemies that we haven't collected the blitties from. Okay, prioritizes the Dark Trasher. So, um, I think that means we have 14 blitties. We gotta time that punch correctly to counteract his punch. Watch out, the hammers can inflict a dizzy. And then, the Dark McCockle. Got a punch. This is another attack you can do where he'll... You gotta try and hold your shell until it hits zero. Not if it dies, it doesn't leave its head. But, we did get a level up. I was thinking power. Um, maybe not. Ooh, defense has five, so of course we get a one. Alright. Bowser's time to shine here. Got an entrance up here. Ooh, outside now. It's cool. What the heck is this thing? It says we need the spike ball for that. Let's try again at this guy. Alright, I believe with this Blitty, that should be the final one, actually. Yeah, um, I have to find a shop block to check, but that might be the last Blitty. And, uh, hmm, if that's the case, I might have to go do something, but hang on, we got some new stuff here. Oh hey, the trash 
finally opened up. Now we can see if this guy gets any better loot. Yeah, it looks like it. Oh my gosh, I think that was a 100 coin. I think that trash who dropped a 100. A 100 coin. Oh boy. Ultra syrup in front of that chair. Oh, another nap lock. I guess I can show off what happens if you um, go into a battle with a nap lock without attacking it. As you can see, they're kind of sleeping. They will attack this dark trasher. Don't have this attack. Make sure you duck under it. You don't want to get hit by that snot bubble. So I guess they do technically have two different attacks. And if you attack them, then they'll wake up. Well, I guess you can show off what this dark bond does. Maybe. <laughs> yes, I did it. After the dark bomb drops, it releases a super huge thing. I don't think I've actually ever done that before. It's actually very precise to do that. And now, after you defeat them, then dark fossil guys will show up. Gotta just attack them. They're not that strong. Oop. <laughs> that was my bad. They just have the same attacks as a regular Fawful guy. But they give out 400 experience. That actually leveled Luigi up to level 29. Alright, he's gonna ignore SP for now. Doesn't seem to have all that much defense. And I finally got a 4 when it was the max thing I could get. Okay. Uh, that might be everything in this room. Let me check. There's that leads back up to the save block room. There's still the whole left half of this castle that we haven't explored yet. But hey, now that we have all the bloodies, I think I might go ahead and cash them in real quickly. So I'll meet you guys back. But I guess first we can open up this green door. Contains an economy ring. What does that do? Um, reduces SP spent for each attack by 50%. Uh, I mean, not that I complain about it. I'd actually maybe rather the um, fill up ring than the economy ring. But, ooh. If you ever complain about it being too expensive, well, there you go. It just got halved. Coming back down to Brock Monjour. Look at this. What is Oh, what is this I see? Bloody mushery. Thank you, mercy. Come to me, bloody. Look at all those bloodies. The last bloody. Ah, it arrives. Success. Ah, we, oui, my petite broggy. You can take a walk at long last. <laughs> what? Broggy, he is straight fast, we. Oui? <laughs> Whoa. Oh. You will walk me, we. Oui? Let us do this, baby. That is what my cute Broggy is saying to you. This is good for me, right? So have you forgotten? Broggy, he is glorious. The moves so fast. The attacks so nasty. The enemies, they will tremble before him. Nice. He's gonna have to work, though. My minions don't slack. Let's roll. Brew, brew, brew. Broggy joined as a minion. Bowser can now use Broggy Bonker in battle. Not gonna practice. I already know how that attack works. Ah, sweet satisfaction! One joy to the bits. You will be the best friend for life! I am the fellow that is uh, to items. Um, never mind. He doesn't tell you about bloodies anymore because we got him. So I guess that means that that's the last Bowser enemy that we've already seen all of the Bowser enemies. So, unless they show up into attack or something, then there's no reason to really show off a battle as Bowser. Of course, besides bosses, too. Um. Yeah. Alright, back in the dining hall. Um, I think it's too early to end off the episode, so I'll continue for a bit more. Maybe this episode will be longer. I know I've been um, underestimating how long the battles take. Oh, oh Wookie went down here. Okay. And I went up this wall. 
two TNT drumsticks, so there's the blue key. I was going back up. What a jerk. Alright, well, that's that down. I can collect those hundred coins. I might as well fight this knapsack or nap lock while we're here. Hmm. Broggy Bonker costs 20 SP. Hmm. Oh, I guess this is the version of the alarm the bombs attack inside Bowser. Okay, so blue guy went back up and down leads to a new area though, so I kinda wanna explore down here first. Even more dark mech offals. We have a bunch of fawful posters. What the heck is up with that? 50 coins and another slide area. Let's fight you. Hmm. You know what? I think I'm gonna do it. Let's show off Broggy Bonker. Only attacks one enemy, but. What you gotta do is you gotta clean him up. You gotta clean him up really well. And, yeah, just like that, I got an excellent. And then, Blitz Dizzy, and. Look at how many times that attacks. With very good high chances of luckies, too. You see how much damage that did? And how easy it was to perform an excellent. Froggy Bonker is by far the best attack. Like, seriously. It might be expensive. From. Wow. What the heck? Okay, I guess we'll just continue then. Might be expensive, but ooh, it's good. It's like really, really good. Now, oh, okay, that just leads us back to the. Oh, I forgot that enemy is sort of respawned, so I guess I'll just go back the way I came. Yeah, I really think that this video has probably gone on for a real long time. So I'll just end it off there. In the next episode, we'll be continue exploring with this great music. And find the other two keys. Uh, I guess we will be rescuing the Magic Hoopas, but I doubt their attack would be better than Broggy's. I mean, you have to vacuum on every enemy, even the ones that don't give you anything from vacuuming. <laughs> okay, so I guess just until next time, goodbye.